Hello, I am Melvin Lee Wright the third, and I would like to sing a Christmas song I made up myself. Please wait, where your please wait, so I can find the microphone or something. Thank you. Can you do that for me. I'll just let you see my Christmas tree. Okay. Christmas is a holiday. You must treasure with your family. Decorating the Christmas tree. Putting presents under it. Wrapping presents is the best. I do think it is. Now would you just sing with me a song I make in myself? Oh, Christmas, oh, Christmas, oh, how the season of Christmas. The winter cold and Santa comes, you got cookies and milk. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas snow, oh, how I love them, but uh oh. Snow is white and friendly flame. Christmas trees are fun to decorate. Oh, Christmas, oh, Christmas season. Oh, how I love the Christmas season. You get to treasure it forever. You get to sleep to wait for presents. You get to heal the reindeer on the roof. The roof. The roof. The most fun part about Christmas is you get to put the star on the Christmas tree and your favorite decorations and you sing your favorite songs but this is a song I made up I'm just making it up as I go Christmas is the season I'd like to treasure forever. Christmas should be everyone's favorite season. Now you will hear the story of the night before Christmas. Thank you. And then, in a twinkling, I heard on the roof the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. 
As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. Wow, and then what? Oh, we're just halfway through the story. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his back. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how merry. His cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf. And I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me to know that I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings, then turned with a jerk, and laying his finger aside of his nose, and giving a nod, up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew like the down of a thistle. But I heard him scream as he drove out of sight. Happy Christmas to all! We'll go on in his story. Rudolph the red nose riding deer. You'll go down in his story. Oh no, it's time to go to bed now. Okay. Merry Christmas. Thank you for listening. I very much love Christmas. Thank you.